Hi, this is Professor Wagner. This is IT076, Introduction to Electronic Commerce or Introduction to E-Commerce. This uh, module, this video module, will talk about the learning objectives for week one, and they correlate to Loudon's chapter one and two, as well as our active discussions online during our distance learning course. Um, I agree with a lot of these learning objectives as important, uh, having been in the business, as you've heard from my intro, of e-commerce since 1996. So we'll focus on about a, a dozen bullets, and I've got them listed here. So if you're able to follow along and concentrate on these key areas, you know, that'll be important. Uh, define e-commerce, describe how it differs from e-business, and we'll get into details through the lessons. Um, the uniqueness of e-commerce technology and its significance is going to be very important. Uh, the labels and buzzwords and jargon that go along with it, including uh, Web 2.0 and how that differs from Web 1.0 and the current world of social commerce. Uh, there's a variety of types of e-commerce. Um, be prepared to understand the origins and history that led to the growth of where e-commerce is today, its evolution, uh, and the factors that define the current landscape as well as the future of e-commerce. There are a variety of themes, uh, many major themes, and take a look at those. Also, there's a variety of academic disciplines contributing to e-commerce, um, not just business, but in the fields of science and entertainment uh, communications, education, and more. Uh, there's a variety of business models on uh, business to consumer, B2C, and business to business, B2B, are the primary ones, but there are a variety of others where educational institutions, government institutions get involved, as well as consumer to consumer, C2C. So uh, be prepared to understand the key business concepts and strategies applicable to e-commerce. So those are the learning objectives for uh, chapters one and two. Thank you.